There we go. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god. That is freaking sick. What's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for 7 Days to Die modded series. Today, we're back on Sorcery Mod. I just popped an invisibility potion, so I don't think anything can see me. Um, no, that's not true. By the way, um, developer, uh, please, invisibility potions? <laughs> can, can, can we have that, please? Man, I, this poor developer. I just keep saying, can we have this? Can we have that? Can we have that? Like, he must have a list of Google Docs, like a mile long, of just stuff I've, I've said... I want in the game. Anyway, guys, we are back on Sorcery Mod. Um, you didn't miss anything. I'm just out here harvesting in the dark, getting as much fire and ice essence as I possibly can. And there has been an update, so I'm going to go through some of the uh, things that are in the update. Uh, faster intro quests. Now, I can't tell you about that because I, you know, I already did my intro quest, but he said it's going to be a lot smoother and a lot quicker. Um, what else? Greatly speeds up the intro process. All right. Plus... Uh, sorry, times three fire essence harvesting for the first ten levels. Did I hear something? Hold on. Don't mess with me, bro. You don't want none of this bad medicine. Um, okay, so hold on. Let's go and repair that. Yeah, so times three on the fire essence in the beginning of the game, which uh, I think is definitely a good change. Uh, base fire essence only. The buff expires at level 10. Other than that, localization changes only. So I wonder if I have the buff. Is that like an actual buff that shows up? Or is that just something that's innate with the game until level 10? I'm already past level 10, so I guess it doesn't matter. Um, speaking of leveling, we have to keep an eye on when I level because I went in and I changed the files. Now, here's the deal, guys. I want to get two level. I want to get two points per level. Now, we have our, we have the base game, which I don't think the fun pimps give, enough, give us enough points for. And then we have this incredible sorcery tree that I just want to freaking dump points into. So I want to have two points per level. I'm already level 12. So as far as I'm concerned, I am 11 points down. So what I did was I put up the points per level time uh, plus three times three. So I'm getting three points per level. And then at level 23, once I'm up to the point where I would have been if I had two points per level the whole way, I will put it back down to two points per level. So basically... Uh, it's up to three points per level until I catch up to where I feel like I should have been. Um, the developer himself has said that there's not enough points in the game for the mod. Um, if I've got any of this wrong, please uh, correct me. Uh, Dev, uh, that's his actual name, Devrix. Um, you know, but he, he said that there's not enough points in the mod uh, and he's working on ways for us to get more points. But there's something going on with the game. There's some kind of bug that I don't understand with the game. And he said that once the fun pimps fix that bug, he would be able to make it so we would be able to get more points naturally without messing around with the XML files. So that brings us up to speed. Um, I think I'm just going to go ahead and mine through the night. I don't, well, we're almost done anyway. So um, I think what we're going to do today, guys, is we, we're just going to quest. We're going to quest, quest, and quest some more. And I really want to put a point into Daring Adventurer um, because I, I want to get a pickaxe. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and mine through the night, but I will have the record key at the ready in case anything crazy happens. All right, guys, it is morning and we are going to head on out to the trader and our drop chest seat we got in there. I am one acid away. I think I'm one acid away from being able to make a bike. I don't know for sure, but I'd really like to be able to make a bike. Um, and you know what else I heard? Uh, I heard that this mod now works with Ravenhurst. Now, here's the thing. Um, they were talking about Darkness Falls is having issues with this mod because of some kind of localization thing I don't know about. <laughs> I don't understand. Uh, but Kane is working on it, and he said it's about 90% done. And here's the thing. Is the localization thing a problem with Ravenhurst as well? Or, like, how does that work? Like, is, I don't know how any of that works. But um, it's pretty exciting, though, man. Like, all these mods working together, man. I can't wait to play this mod with, like, all the other mods. It's going to be sweet. Oh, this place isn't open. What the hell am I thinking? All right, well, let's check the, the drop chest. Oh, the drop chest is empty. All right, well, you know what? If the drop chest is empty, then I should definitely not leave the marker there. Uh, I'll leave the chest there, though. Oh, boy, we got to wait for this to be... Is there any zombies in the round we can kill? Oh, I want to kill some zombies. Hello, zombies. You know what? Let's go ahead and break this up, see if we can get some... Yeah, there we go. See if we can get some... Uh... Some wonderful, wonderful honey. Honey? It's not honey, is it? Is it honey? Yes, honey. I don't know why I had a problem with that. But... Alright, zombies. I want to kill something, man. Ain't nothing to kill. I've been mining boulders all night. I don't want to mine any more boulders, damn it. Alright, fair enough. 
All right, guys, we're back. I just killed a couple zombies, you know, punched up a bunch of bushes. I got 38 chrysanthemums. I always find myself needing more chrysanthemums, and I never have enough. So I figured I would just punch them up while I'm waiting. And I don't want to hit any boulders because I'm just sick of hitting boulders all night. I, I, I'll, next time I hit, next time I go on a boulder thing, I want to be using a pick. So let's keep our fingers crossed about that. All right, go. Close it up. All right, what you got for me? What you got? Do I even have any dukes? Did I bring any? Did I make any? I don't even know. I don't even know what's going Come on. Speak with me, friend. Uh, yeah, I'll take that fetch quest. God bless. And what do you got for sale? I think does this person have like a ridiculous pick? Oh no, today's today's day four. They restocked. Uh, oh, I really want that bottle of acid. That'll be for my bike. Oh wow, some good stuff for sale. You always have the good stuff for sale when you can't afford it. Oh, sorcerer shades! Sorcerer shirt! I already have a shirt, but still, it's pretty cool. Um, oh, there's... Wait, wait, wait a minute. If we ain't got what it's day four. For, How do you steal that pick? I guess they don't always get rid of their stuff. I thought they did. I thought they got, like, brand new stuff, but I guess not. Uh, I kind of want that pick. God knows when we get that much money, though. Well, I'll do a few quests. It's not, it's not out of the realm of possibility. Um, ice... Ice Essence Boon. Uh, invoke the Ice Essence Boon rude word to discover harvest more. Oh, see, it helps you get more Ice Essence. Ice Essence. 10% more. That's a lot. Damn. Uh, wow. Wait, how much does mine sell for? Uh, well, it's still, still a pretty good amount. But come on, man. You're going to buy it for 1000 and sell for 23000 you freaking jerk. Rune Deep Freeze. Invoke the Deep Freeze rune word. Uh... Uh, only the following spell casts uh, deep freeze chance to deep freeze your foe when landing a direct spell wow so cool so cool all right there's nothing what do these sell for these don't sell for anything okay um oh that might sell for a lot because i got a i got a mod in it anyway let's go do some quests i want to get a pick all right so where's this quest where is i gotta get that bike too man we're gonna get that second acid I want to have I want to have a bike by uh by next episode. Oh God, <laughs> I'm all looking out here. It's like right next to me. Let's go do this. Hell's to the freaking yeah. Probably you know, I don't know why I mark it with the red red flag. Usually I have so many like markers on my screen that I get confused on what's where. So I mark it with the red flag. Why not? Why not? That's what I always say. Let's grab these, get some eggs. You should give us some kind of spell to conjure magic eggs. For bacon and eggs. Yeah, that's asking too much, I know. And yes, it's broken. And no, I'm not serious, but still, it'd be pretty cool. Magic, right? Oh, isn't this the world where I, I found the, um... I found the prison? Remember Harry Potter goes to jail? Where, where did I find the prison? I don't remember. I think it's up here somewhere. Yep, there it is. Harry Potter goes to jail. We gotta move in there, man. God, there's so much to freaking do. Just not enough time in the day. Just not enough time. That's it, guys. I have to clone myself. It's the only way. So, hey, how about that for a magic spell? Clone. I want a clone spell. It spawns another version of you to fight on your side for 10 seconds. Takes half your half your spirit. And in case you guys are wondering, those little balls at the feet are how many spells the guy has on him. And they do stack. Because this is, the, like, the best mod ever made. Like, just ridiculous. I say that about every mod when I first play it, by the way. <laughs> every mod is the best mod ever made. They're all the best. Okay. Center of mass. By the way, um, do spells count on headshots? I don't know. Sound like that fire is behind me, man. Maybe a little nervous. Yes, man. Clone. I want a clone spell, please. For all that is good in this world. Finish the Necromancer first, though. <laughs> God, it, I'll tell you right now. You get a Necromancer in this game, it's GG. So why is there a green flame when I'm pulling back the... When I'm pulling back the uh, imaginary bow? That's interesting. I never noticed that before. You notice that? Right now there's a purple flame. And when I go to aim, 
there is a green flame. Hmm. Interesting. Ugh, please tell me there's no vultures here. Freaking hate vultures. So what kind of spell would be the best to slaughter vultures? Hmm, I don't know. Alright, I don't see any. So hopefully there's none over there. Should we do this twice? Usually what I do is I'll clean out the area, and then I'll start the quest and then clear it out again. I, oh, this is an interesting POI. I've never done this one before. Oh, this isn't the one, apparently. Oh, that's still a cool POI, though. All right, fair enough. By the way, I gotta start thinking about Horde Knight, guys. I don't want to do Horde Knight. I want to freaking cast spells. Ooh, spell traps. Are there any kind of spell traps in the mod? That, that would make Horde Knight a lot more fun. So should we clear this out and then go back? Nah, I want to do the quests. I want to get some quests done. That's going to be my best chance at getting a pick, which is my number one concern. Locked. Oh. Double stack fire. Okay. All right. I wonder if they go melee if uh, they they get in here. So, what do we got here? Bones. Bones for days! Toilet? We got any magic toilet water? No? Alright. No magic toilet water. Guess you can't have it all. Nope. Oh, I just lit the door on fire. Can I get it back? No. Oh! Stupid door. Dude, did that just AoE both of them? Did I hit the floor? I didn't think I did. I think that's AoE in both of them. I thought you have to I thought you have to hit the ground to AoE them. Has that changed? Look at that. I got three skill points. What up? Yes, wow. Is that new? I'm pretty sure that's new. Because I thought I had to hit like I thought if you hit one zombie, that was no AoE. And the, the, the trade-off was if you hit the floor for the AoE, you don't get the spell back. But Oh, okay. So, I don't know. I guess they've always been like that. I, I don't know. I didn't realize. That is freaking epic. Oh, 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 oh. Ice Essence Boon. That's got to go in armor, right? i got to go in armor. Sounds like it would go in armor. Nope. So does that go in the... the well, I guess I should read it. Invoke the essence boon, rude word, discover blah, blah, blah. Discover harvest 10% more, all sources, stamina. Only tools. Okay. Yeah, Cage, if you read it, you would have been a lot happier. Uh, modify. There we go. I'm just so excited. I don't want to read. I want to cast spells. Come on. Come on. Come up. Suck it! Ha! <laughs> Shot a rating in me. You die now. Thank you. I think I'm going to get a lot of hate for this. And I really don't want to say it. Because I feel like a dick. But I'm going to give a little balance critique here. Uh, I really hate to say this. I really don't want to say it. I, I don't think you should have 100% to get the spells back every time. Uh, cringe. I can't believe I said that. I really do. It, they're really powerful. And, like, I feel like getting it back every time, you've got never-ending... You've got never-ending ranged AoE. Ah. Uh, I'm sorry. I, 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 it's, it's how I feel. Oop. 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 Oh, Devrix just said... 
Neither do I. It's a game bug. Okay, cool. So I didn't I didn't just cause anyone any heartache. It was not intended, and he will fix it. Okay, fair enough. Okay. By the way, I'm streaming this as well, and I got the mod developer in the stream, and he said he doesn't want you to get any spells back. Well, I don't know if I would go that far, but I guess it's not that big of a deal because they are super powerful. But, yeah, I do like getting some of them back. But he did up the uh, he did up the harvest rate, you know, on getting the essence and stuff below level 10, so that does help. But you know what it is? You know what it is? It's a brand new mod. I'm super excited, and I want everything yesterday. You know what I mean? I just want to do everything right now, and I don't have any time to be waiting around for stuff. So, but you know, once we get used to the mod and everything, and it's not like super, super fresh, um, I think we'll really appreciate um, the fact that it's not, it doesn't come so fast, you know? How's your arm feel, bro? There we go. Da, 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 da. Oh boy, hold on. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, AOE, baby. See, now this is, you, what you would do is normally you would save all your spells for this room. Yeah. Whoa, that was awesome. Okay. Oh, I didn't get any spells back. All right, well, I'm not supposed to, so. <laughs> I guess that's fine. Or did I take them back and I didn't realize? No, I definitely lost them. Oh, boy. Whoop. Here's another thing about getting the spells back here. I'm going to say right now, I think getting the spells back 100% is a little bit more balanced than I once thought and i'm going to tell you why we don't have enough points for this skill tree and he can't put the, he can't give us the points that we need for the skill tree because like i said or mentioned earlier some kind of bug with the game um and we will get more points for this skill tree but because we don't have the skill enough skills for this skill tree we're gonna have to put you know we're gonna have to put more points over here so you know i think normally if we don't get any spells back we can build up our melee abilities and we can melee and cast spells when it makes sense. But right now we can skip the melee tree and just put everything into the spell tree. And because we're short on spell uh, skills, it's not that bad. So yeah. All right. Well, let's finish up this quest. Uh, there's no big loot at the end. Oh, I'm not at the end. Oh God. Scared the ever loving F out of me. Freaking took years off my life. He didn't even have to lay a hand on me. There's only one zombie. It's just I didn't expect it. Alright, let's do this. Okay, 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 okay. What was that? Daring adventure. That is pretty much awesome. That's it. I mean, I'm going to go ahead and turn in this quest. It's exactly what I needed. Dun, 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 dun. Why, am I, why am I not spending my skill points? I don't know. I probably should. Nobody asked me that either. Um, yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll spend a minute. A minute. <gasps> That's what I'm talking about. F, yeah. Got a pick. That's what I wanted. That's phenomenal. Let's look at our skills. Okay. So I believe we need fire mastery because then I can get tier two fire. Right? And we want to do spell fire too. Wait. No. How do I get fire mastery? How do I get the... um? Learn tier two fire spell crafting. You can now alter fire spells. You cast fire spells 10% faster. Awaken fire to essence. And a chance to harvest. You have learned how to craft fire core. But what do I have to... Oh, fire nato. There we go. Okay, so we need to... All right. I want fire nato. 
So in order to do fire NATO, we need we need uh, fire two. So we're gonna put one point there, one point there, and there we go. All right, guys, we are back to the trader. And the uh, developer explained to me what the problem is with skill points. And what he wants to do is he wants to give us, you know, quests that we basically kill zombies and we can get quest rewards, which will be extra skill points. The problem is if we kill a zombie with fire or some kind of spell, it, it won't register as a quest update. So that's the issue. Um, also, since I'm here, let's go ahead and read Daring Adventure. Okay. Greeting, stranger. Yeah. I've got the best deal. Wow. In the um. Game. Hmm. <laughs> I don't. Well, I don't need to pick, obviously. Uh, I guess I gotta go with the ice spell, right? I mean, I do like leather boots too. I've got a lot of ice essence. I'm gonna go with the leather boots. All right, another quest. Ah, these are all farther away. Very surprised. All right, let's see if we can buy that acid. We got it. We got paid for that, right? Yep, that's enough for the acid. Where's the acid? There it is. Now, what are, what else do we need for the bicycle? Because I really want a bicycle. Uh, forged iron. Can I? Man, I don't even know what's going on. I'm so freaking hyped about this mod that I don't even remember if I had a forge or not. I don't think I do. Uh, but I can. So should we make a forge, get some forged iron? What else do we need for the bike? Duct tape. I think I have the I think I have the duct tape. I think I have everything I need for the bike. Well, let's get home. We're gonna work on the fire NATO spell. And then we're gonna we're gonna mess around with the fire NATO spell, and I'm gonna try and see if I can get a bike. If we don't get a bike today, um, I'm probably gonna have it by uh, next video. So let's get home and get some. Let's get our fire NATO on, boy. All right, guys, we are back, and I needed to grab some cars because I need oil to make the bi bicycle, and I also put one point into salvage operations. I put I don't know if I showed you this, but I put a point into uh, fire mastery just in case I didn't uh, ice mastery. And I've got all the spell casting, and I've got some Fire Nato cooking up. Fire Nato is super expensive. Uh, you have to mine boulders to get Fire Two, and as you go up in, as you go up in tiers, like Fire Two is is more rare than Fire One in the boulders. Um, so as you go up in tiers, that's going to be um, a lot more rare. Also, you can mine underground for those things, right? There we go. We got seven. Uh, should we put these in here? Yeah, let's do that. There we go. You can mine underground for those as well. Um, coal and shale uh, is what you mine for fire spells. And I forget what the rest of them were. The guy, the dude, the developer said, but I, I, I missed it. Um, lead is lightning, I believe. Right? And potassium nitrate is is ice, I think. Pretty sh maybe kind of kind of sure. Kind of a little bit sure. Anyway, let's go ahead and use this. Uh, let's go ahead and use this spell. We're gonna we're gonna go find some zombies. I want to see what the spell does because the developer said I will be much appreciative about the spell. So let's see what it's all about. Uh, we'll just go mess around the church. Okay. Oh, apparently I already cleaned out the church. Let's go to the booby trap. Okay. Knock, knock. Wake up. Help me out. Okay, fire NATO. Oh. That wasn't fire NATO. Okay, one second. How do I do fire NATO then? Hold down R? Yes. There we go. Come on, I'm going to get a bunch of these guys together because I'm pretty sure this is going to have some hellish AoE effect. Come on, group up. Group up, fellas. Okay. Fire NATO! He's dead. It kind of looked like the same spell effect, or did I just miss it? Give me a fire NATO. Did I get the fire NATO back? Oh, I didn't. Was that the fire nato or did I? It was the fire nato because I spent it. 
But you don't get the fire needle back, huh? That's interesting. Any other zombies in here? Should be, right? There we go. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god. That is freaking sick. Wow. I don't know if it does more damage, but it looks badass. Is there any way to tell the damage on these? Does it say? Uh, sets a blaze, AoE spawn. Oh. Hold on. Let's take a look. A highly destructive manifestation of fire that incinerate ash and blah blah blah. Sets foes ablaze, amplify, empower an enemy burn stacks. Okay. So it's, I think it works the same way as the other one. All right, here we go. Taste my fire, NATO. Oh man, two apps updates. I don't even know if that, that showed up on screen or not. Look at that. Oh, got the fire, NATO back. Okay, cool. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, there we go. It, it, it spread. It spread. So does the fire nado really do that much more damage? Because it doesn't. I don't feel like it does. Like I still had to hit her twice. Oh, another pick. Very nice. Give me that back. That it? We done in here? Man, I want to use the fire nado spell some more. Watch out for that mine. All right, let's uh, let's let's try and find a few more zombies. Um, you know what? We'll do Butcher Pete's, just the front or the back. The first room. How about the first room? So the Fire Nato thing also doesn't have the little circles around their feet. Oh God! Son of a bitch! Piece of crap, dog. Uh, do I have a knife? Huh. I don't have a knife. Okay. Fair enough. Woke up all the zombies. Alright, so let's see if we get any more fire things around his feet. Nah, no, see, no fire things. Now, will I get both of those, um... Both of those back when he's dead? See, I feel like fire the first fire spell would have killed him in, in two stacks. As a matter of fact, I can almost guarantee it would have. Here, hold on. I'll prove it. Here we go. Watch. Two stacks. This guy will die. Wait, what? Okay, hold on. I messed something up. Okay, let's try that again. Hold on, buddy. We're, we're testing. We're testing the mod. Okay. Did it switch? It switched. Okay. Alright, so there we go. One. And stacked. He'll die. He'll die from that. See? The fire NATO spell is weaker. I'm gonna ask the dev about that. Maybe it's a bug. Or maybe it's only good once it's um maybe it's only good once it's like upgraded. Okay, come on guys. Get group up. This is gonna be this is gonna be great. Come on. Come on. We want don't worry, Edgar, there's room for you. There's room for you. Only base spell up, up only base spell apply stacks. Oh, so only the first spell stacks. Okay. Okay, well, if that's the case, then Fire Nato is not that, not that useful, I don't think. Burn! That's right, spread that fire. Spread that fiery love. Okay. Get my spells back. Leveled up again. You die now. I give you my spells back. Alright, 
Man, I love that AoE. That is so freaking good. All right, let's go ahead and chop this dog up. Get a bone. All right, guys. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. All right, guys, I'm back at base. I'm going to put this on at the end of the video. Um, Devrix, the developer, wanted me to let you guys know that there's a bug when you switch. Basically, it sounds to me like the developer wants us to switch spells quite often. But there's a bug right now. If you switch the spells, it doesn't, it like screws up. There's like a bug with it. So what the developer wanted me to let you guys know is he wants you to make two fire spell cast or whatever spell cast. Make two spell casts. Have one on one, one on the other, and then you could just switch back and forth. You know, if you want to, uh, you know, combo spells. He said there's a lot of opportunities to combo spells. So make yourself in a different, uh, make yourself a second spell cast um, until they can get that ammo bug uh, fixed. All right, guys, I'm going to put this on at the end of the video because the developer's explaining to me how this stuff works. Um, basically, we have two fire spells, right? I have two fire spells. I have the tier one fire spell that I've been using the whole time, and then fire nato, which is uh, the tier two fire spell. I'll just call them, I don't know their names right now. I'm just going to call them that for now. All right. Now, the tier one fire spell, the damage, the, the stacking damage is not stacking damage over time. As far as I understand it, let me know if I've got this wrong, Devrix. When you cast the first tier one fire spell, fire spell, it's just called fire spell, it does damage over time. But the damage over time doesn't stack. What it does is the more stacks you have on the zombie, the more damage they take from future fire spells. Okay? So fire one will basically, I mean, you could think of it as like um, lowering their fire resistance, basically. Um, so what, what I'm being told is stack up the fire one spell on the zombies and then finish them off with fire nato do i have that right and by the way if you're wondering what i'm doing here on in the youtube video i'm basically getting a thumbnail and i want to gather up as many zombies as i can for fire nato for the thumbnail <laughs> all right so do i have that right all right let's get this you guys are going to be able to watch me get the thumbnail that's pretty cool all right guys fire nato yeah thumbnail Okay, just your thumbnail. Get that fire NATO going. Yeah! That is giving me one sexy ass thumbnail. Hell yeah. So many people are gonna watch this video if I don't get killed. Burn! Come on, one more. One more. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Great spell effects. Alright guys, that's the end of the video. I'll see you next time.